Are you struggling to pass the FE exam? Do you want practical tips to solve problems effectively and efficiently? In this week's Pass the FE exam video, I'm gonna be sharing nine essential problem solving tips that'll help you to pass the FE exam with confidence. From understanding the exam format to managing your time wisely, we've got you covered. Now, whether you're a first time test taker or trying again, these tips will give you the edge that you need to succeed. Let's dive right in. Preparing for the FE exam can be overwhelming, and students face many challenges from managing a vast amount of material like mathematics, science, and other various engineering topics to navigating the exam's format and structure. Time management during this test is a common struggle, as is the pressure to perform well, which can lead to anxiety and stress. And additionally, not having access to effective resources and guidance make it difficult to create a study plan that works. So it's no surprise that many students struggle to pass the exam on their first attempt. But the good news is that with the right problem solving tips, you can overcome these challenges and significantly improve your chances of success. Now, here are nine tips that can help you to navigate through this challenging, but potentially career game changing process. Tip number one, you want to focus on high impact topics, zero in on the most critical exam topics and identify the areas that carry the most weight and prioritize your study time there. By focusing on high impact material, you can maximize your score potential and avoid wasting time on less important sections. Tip number two, you want to understand core concepts, not just formulas. Don't just memorize formulas. Understand the concepts behind them. A solid grasp of the fundamentals will help you to approach problems logically and think critically, which is essential for tackling unfamiliar or complex questions. Coming in at number three, you want to practice regularly. Now, consistent practice is key here. Work through a variety of problems to mimic the actual exam experience, and this is going to help to build your confidence, improve your speed, and also help you to pinpoint areas that you need extra attention. Tip number four, you want to learn to interpret questions effectively. By carefully reading and interpreting exam questions, that can make all of the difference. Look for keywords and phrases, break problems into smaller parts, and use tools like diagrams and flowcharts to simplify complex scenarios. This structured approach will help you to develop clear solutions. Number five, you want to establish a pre-exam routine. Now, create a routine that helps you to stay calm and focus on exam day. Get plenty of sleep, exercise, and eat a nutritious meal to ensure that you're physically and mentally prepared to tackle that test. Number six, you want to master time management during the exam. Plan your time wisely during the test. Allocate sufficient time to each question and leave a room at the end of each one to review your answers. Learning how to pace yourself will reduce stress and help you to perform your best. Coming in at number seven, you want to stay positive and motivated. Celebrate your small wins during your preparation. Reward yourself for completing milestones to keep your motivation high and maintain a positive mindset throughout your study process. Number eight, you want to seek support and also resources. You don't want to do this alone. Leverage resources like study groups, review courses, tutors, all to stay on track. These support systems can provide valuable insight and encouragement when you need it the most. Tip number nine, and this is the most important tip, master the art of reading and interpreting questions. Of all the tips, this one is the most important. This skill unlocks the entire problem solving process and sets apart successful test takers. By identifying keywords, breaking down problems, and using visual aids, you'll be able and equipped to handle any challenging problems that the exam is going to throw your way. You can tackle the FE exam with confidence. Now, remember, success isn't just about memorizing formulas. It's about understanding concepts, approaching problems methodically, and also staying positive throughout your preparation. You've got this. Now, I hope that you all found this week's video to be very helpful. And just remember that in upcoming videos, we're going to be answering more of your FE exam related questions and run through some more practice problems for you all. Pass the FE exam will publish videos weekly, so please be sure to hit that subscribe button as you're going to be getting expert tips and tricks, including practice problems and solutions weekly. And we do this to make sure that you're going to pass that FE exam. And I encourage you all to ask questions in the comment section that we're going to be reading and responding to in future videos. So if there's a specific topic that you want us to cover or a question that you want to have answered, be assured that pass the FE exam will have you covered. I'll see you all next week.